periodic cleaning of the bore and chamber and lubrication of your double action SP-101, GP-100, and Super Red Hawk can be performed without disassembling your gun. However, if your gun has been exposed to adverse conditions, we recommend a thorough cleaning and lubrication to keep it in proper working order. To do a thorough job, you will need the correct size fiber or brass bore brush, a cleaning rod coated with either aluminum, brass, plastic, or carbon fiber equipped with a tip attachment in which a cloth patch can be installed. You will also need patches, powder solvent, a good gun oil, a small lint-free cloth, or a bristle brush like a toothbrush. Choose the correct size patches and brushes so they don't become lodged inside the bore. Also cover your work surface with a drop cloth to protect it from solvents and also you will need eye protection. Open the cylinder and make sure that the revolver is completely unloaded. Clean your unloaded revolver from the muzzle by running a cleaning rod with a solvent wetted patch through the bore several times. The cylinder chamber should be cleaned in the same manner. Swab out all chambers with a solvent wetted patch. Follow this up with a pass of the correct size solvent wetted brass brush Then wipe clean with dry patches. When the patches finally come out white, run a clean patch through the bore a couple more times to ensure no fouling remains. Pay special attention to build up of firing residue on the chamber throats in the forcing cone of the barrel. If this occurs, scrub off the residue with a solvent wetted brush, then wipe clean and dry with a rag. Run a very lightly oiled patch through the bore and all six chambers of the cylinder. Do not apply excessive oil to the underside of the ejector or star. This area should be wiped dry. Lastly, wipe down the exterior of your revolver, especially if you're going to store your gun. Thanks for watching this Ruger Tech tip.